गुड मॉर्निंग वी आर गोइंग टूवर्ड्स हो या नोइंग We started early in the morning. Took a taxi from Patong to Bang Rao Pier. From from there, a lot of frequent boats go to uh, Koh Yao Islands. That is Koh Yao Yai or and Koh Yao Nai, Noi, Koh Yao Noi. And uh, you can either take a speed boat ride or a long tail ferry. A speed boat ride costs you three hundred baht, and long tail will take you two hundred baht. But uh, long tail will take. Longer time to reach the Koyao Noi Islands. If you are going to Koyao Noi, then uh, you there is another ferry where there is a less frequent boats are there, so you can uh, you know take a taxi to that ferry and uh, you know you can take the boat. But as we are going to Koyao Noi, so we had to come to Bangrao, and the taxi fare was around eight hundred. This is our luggage. We have just arrived in Sun Globe Resort, Sun Globe Resort. and this is our room, room number Sun Globe one zero three. And this is way better than I thought. This is just in front of our room. There is a pool. You can chill out here. And the huts are very colorful. We have a blue color hut. This is my favorite color. And let's see how it is. In. Let's see how it is. This is the room we got in. And this is, this is an a, awesome room. This is a beautiful room we got with a flat screen TV, nice bed, with tea coffee maker. Thank God we have tea coffee because we were surviving without that. There's a mini fridge, towels, toiletries, umbrellas they have provided. That's brilliant. There's a locker, much awaited blue, the umbrellas, this is a washroom, hot and cold water, and uh, nice, I'm guessing they'll provide the toiletries, so I'll just see where the toiletries are. It's a small room but nicely done. Not much surface area. So this room costed us around uh, 4757 rupees. That is uh, 2233 baht with breakfast. And uh, it's a pretty good deal. Though it's a little bit expensive than what we got. But it is better than what we had in Phuket. So we are all set, it's raining, a little bit sunny and it's raining like a tropical weather. We got this scooter, 250 baht per day, which is a bit expensive than me, but can't do much.
So we were hoping for a sunset view at Ko Yao Nai and uh, we came towards one of the uh, westmost part uh, in the northern side with a broken pier or some kind and looks like they're building it. The view is not that good because it's a low tide but uh, if this construction was not going on then it would have been very nice. arrived at the secret beach and we just saw a hornbill hello friends we are at the secret hideout beach right now and this is a low tide so there are the water levels have been far away the Koyao Nawi has a little bit less sandy beaches so if you are more fond of sandy beaches not photography purpose not photography purpose but you want to enjoy so you should go to Koyao Yai because there are less um, there are more sandy beaches that side what we can uh, in but Koyao Nawi has good rainforest and nice uh, rocky uh, beach side and stuff so we have to go ahead and look tomorrow we explore the east coast so that might be a little bit exciting we came back and uh, there was no such sunset uh, which we are hoping to and we uh, we had parceled our food because our hotel you know just shuts down after 5 p.m all the employees leave so we got um, pad thai and green curry with chicken and rice we ate outside by the pool that night if you're enjoying our thailand series please don't forget to like share and subscribe our channel do hit the bell icon to get notified when the next episode gets live. Keep traveling like we do.